Alright, today I'll be showing you what a torrent does for you and how you get torrents and what you get out of them. <clears throat> so, um, first, um, to get the torrent software, you want to go to utorrent.com. There's a lot of different types of uh, torrents out there, uh, programs. But um, I use this one, and then um, when it comes up to that website, there's this big green button on the side that says Get You Torrent, and you click on that, and you download it, and you install it. Once you have it installed, um, you want to go to a torrent search engine. There's a lot of different ones out there. I use the PirateBay.org and Mininova. Um, so once you go, I'll put these all these in the description to these links. But um, once you come to the PirateBay.org, um, the search engine down here. Um, whatever you wanted to download, if you want to download um, movies, if you want to download uh, audio, applications, games, any stuff like that, you can download, um, like applications, you can download Photoshop, you can download any application, Nero, whatever you want. So say you want to download a video, um, you always want to put keywords in your search that will help you narrow it down. So say you want um, Forgetting Sarah Marshall. Um, after it, you're going to want to put keywords. So, say you want it in English, you can put ENG. Say you want it in DVD format instead of like a camera, you want to put DVD. And then um, click on this video check down there, which helps narrow it down. Click Pirate Search. There we go. Um, and it came up with, it narrowed it down to these. Now, usually, when you if you'll type in just like Forgetting Star Marshall, it'll come up with about 100 results. And narrowing it down really helps. Um, choose the best options. So, um, you get these five options, and, um, there's these things called seeds and peers over here, S-E and L-E. Um, you want more seeds than you have L-E. So, um, you want to find one with that. So, and when you're looking for a video file, um, like a movie, you usually want it between 700 meg and about 1,000 meg or gig, um, because that's about the right size for a movie. So this one has 129, and you want to look for the best ratio in favor of seeds, because the more seeds you have, the faster your download's going to be. So, um, 19 to 9, that's what, 1 to, well, I don't know. I'll just click on this 129, 49 one right here. Um, so once you click on it, um, click on it, and it comes down, and you see download this torrent, click on that, and save it wherever you're going to remember to uh, get it from, so click OK. And it downloads pretty quick. So once you have that downloaded, come here and you can see I downloaded it to my desktop. Um, you'll double click it. Well, if it comes up uh, looking like that, you have like a Windows XP and it comes up with that, that means it doesn't recognize the program you want to use for this file. It doesn't recognize the extension. So um, you want to right click on it and go to Open With. And um, if you see uTorrent, then you want to click on uTorrent. Or if it you doesn't say that, just go to Choose Program and choose uTorrent. So once it does that, you want to click where you want to save it and everything. So I'll just save it right there. Um, see up here is where you choose, and you click on the little three dots to show where you want to save it. And then you go once you're good with that, click OK. Uh, oh, it just says a newer version of uTorrent. Uh, if you want the newer version, click Yes. But I'll just do this for, for sake's purposes. And, um, like now, sometimes it'll just, uh, open in the background. See, you can see it's open since it went down there in my little tray. So double click it and you can see here. Um, so like I said, you're gonna want more seeds than you have peers. Because, um, the seeds are how many people have the actual file and the peers are the people downloading it. So the more seeds you have, the quicker it's gonna go. Um, downloading a movie can take anywhere from two hours to two days. It depends on, you, it can take up to a week, actually. Um, so that's why you want to make sure you have more seeds and peers, so it'll go a lot quicker. But this is a pretty promising file. So once, um, this is all down, done downloading, you'll have your movie, um, or whatever file you downloaded. Um... So that's what a torrent does for you. It it's it's usually pretty pretty good in terms of uh, viruses. You might accidentally get a file with a virus. It's never really happened to me, I don't think before. But when I usually download torrents, um, I like to do it at night because when I'm asleep, I'll just leave my computer overnight while it's downloading. Because um, if you 
download torrents during the day, it really, really decreases your bandwidth on your internet connection because it's downloading so much data over your internet. So, um, if you're going to do that, be sure to do it at night because if you're playing a game, you'll just, it'll be terrible. It'll just be so slow. So really do make sure you do this at night. Um, that's all I have to say about torrents. If you have any questions or any constructive criticism I might have done wrong, be sure to comment. Please comment. Please um, message me. Um, subscribe even, and uh, check out my other videos. In uh, a previous or in the next video, I'll be sure to, or I'll show you how to convert movie files to iPod format or any format you want. Um, so be sure to watch that. Thanks for watching. Uh, bye.